Good morning to everybody. Can you hear me? Yeah? I'd like to welcome everybody to Saturn 2016. My name is Bill Pollack, and I'm the general chair of Saturn. I'd like to begin by asking you all to read this very carefully. Got it? OK. <laughs> well, thanks for being here. Really looking forward to a great week. And I'd like to begin by introducing you to our uh, program co-chairs. That's Amin Shigani from GE Digi Digital, Amin, and Jorn Olmheim from State Oil. And they will be coming up here to tell you more about the program in a moment. Uh, I'd also like our technical committee members to stand, if you would, please. Uh, George Fairbanks, uh, Ray Hernandez. Uh, Ray helped us out here in the, the San Diego area, and uh, he was our kind of local chair for the conference. Michael Keeling, uh, John Klein is in the back, uh, Rod Nord, there's Rod, and uh, Ipek Ozkaya, and Olaf Zimmerman is not with us uh, today. But the committee did a terrific job of putting things together, and I think by the end of the week you'll agree. Uh, everybody's going to want to know Michelle False back there. And uh, Katy Perry, uh, if you have any problems of any kind, uh, they're the ones who can solve them. And our social media chair is Shane McGraw. Shane is up here. And you'll see Shane outside some of the rooms this week uh, asking you to do short video uh, interviews uh, about you know, what you're learning here at Saturn that we'll uh, use on our website. And so uh, uh, Shane would appreciate your participation in that. Uh, we have a lot of people who have uh, volunteered to be session monitors, and uh, you'll be meeting some of them during the rest of the week. I want to acknowledge our program committee. They are the, the folks who reviewed all of the uh, proposals and, again, did a great job of putting everything together. We have a lot of sponsors here this year at Saturn. Our gold sponsors, AltSource, GE Digital, Travelers, our silver sponsor, IBM Watson, and our bronze sponsor, sponsors, Health Equity and State Oil. And uh, we appreciate their support. Um, we also have some exhibit sponsors that you'll see out in the general area, out in the hallway. And I want to make you aware of a demonstration that's going to be given today after the afternoon break. Uh, Kurt Stam from um, Red Hat will be giving a demonstration that I think, uh, I think you'll enjoy. We have a lot of organizations that have three or more attendees, and they're listed here. Uh, we've asked alcohol monitoring systems to stay away from the uh, <laughs> reception tonight. No, just, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> So again, we have a great uh, international representation. Actually, the map is inaccurate in a couple of ways. We had someone from Jamaica come uh, and register late, and so you will not see a red circle above Jamaica, and you won't see one under, under, over Sweden either. But uh, we have 215 people, and this is the largest Saturn conference we've ever had. So we really appreciate your support. And I got off the plane and looked around at San Diego, and I said, why aren't there 515 people here? Because this is a beautiful, beautiful setting. Um, but after all the excitement we had last year in Baltimore, we think we, uh, we were owed one, and we got it. So, <laughs> A lot of first-time attendees and great support from the great state of California, so we appreciate that. Several people have asked about Wi-Fi. Um, Take a look at this. The network is Sheraton Meeting, and the password is Saturn2015 with a lowercase s. And I think you saw when you came in today that we have a tweet wall up, and we'll have that in all the rooms, right, Shane? Uh, just this one. Oh, just this one? Okay. For the plenary sessions, we'll have tweet wall up. So um, if you want uh, two and a half minutes of fame, you can uh, tweet to the uh, uh, hashtag Saturn16, and uh, you'll see your name up on the screen. But that's, of course, not the only reason to tweet. Um, we want to keep the, uh, the dialogue going uh, and, and the conversation going in the tweet channel. And so we'd appreciate you uh, joining in. 
Uh, you, you saw the voting cards on your uh, chairs, and we give out a, uh, an award at the end of the conference for um, in two categories, uh, Architecture and Practice Award, and uh, the other one I think is called the New Directions Award or something. Yeah. Uh, and the descriptions of what they are are on your cards. And what we'd like you to do is when you go to sessions um, and someone gives a presentation, just uh, kind of mark on your card you know, yay, nay, or not sure, I, th I think are the, th the three choices there. And then we'll collect your cards at the end and uh, um, the highest rated presentations will um, we'll get those two awards and we'll confer those at the end of the conference. So we're pretty excited about uh, a couple of events that are going on and I wanna give you some information about them. We will be doing our reception tonight at Petco Park, the uh, uh, Padres will be playing the Colorado Rockies. Um, both teams, I think, have been uh, underperforming this year, so uh, it should be a competitive match between them. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So uh, there'll be buses out in front of the hotel beginning at 5.30 to take you out there. And for those of us who are on East Coast time who get tired before the end of the uh, ball game and want to go back, buses will be returning uh, periodically. Um, so, you know, you won't be stranded out there for an extra inning game uh, tonight if you don't want to be there. But there's a, a real nice uh, reception area there and it, it should be a lot of fun and food will be served beginning at six o'clock. Did I forget anything? Ah. Well, the other thing is we're trying to get a, a good head count so we know, you know how many tickets we need. So uh, if you haven't told the folks at the, at the front desk whether you're going or not, please do. And uh, if you've changed your mind in, either in one way or the other, um, please let them know. Uh, another really cool event that we have coming is, uh, is, is Wednesday night, 6 p.m., uh, kids and IOT. There are going to be some uh, kids coming in. They're going to set up uh, an IoT uh, educational platform and uh, do a demonstration. I, I think Amin and Yorn will tell you a little bit more about that uh, when they get up here, but that's definitely something you don't want to miss. Um, we have dedicated some space in Fairbanks D, that's uh, I think the last room over down the hall, uh, for what we call office hours, and that's an opportunity to meet one-on-one uh, -on -one or in small groups with some of our speakers. and. Uh, um, today, Mr. Mr. Booch, who will be coming up to talk to you in a little while, has uh, kindly agreed to be um, in that room between 3 and 4.30, and also Patrick Gua and uh, Owen Woods. So uh, um, please consider that as you look at the schedule, and there will also be some office hours with some of our other speakers uh, on Thursday. <coughs> A big part of what we try to do here at Saturn is networking and to help uh, facilitate that. We have these little speaker, these little stickers at the front desk that you can grab and you can kind of put the things that you're interested in talking about and uh, wear it on your lapel or, you know, put it on your badge or something and, uh, um, you know, that uh, we hope will we'll start some conversations among people uh, of like mind who are interested in some of the same things. Um, a lot of people have asked me about PowerPoint presentations and videos. Uh, we put PowerPoint presentations up on the website, the Saturn website, usually within a week after the conference has ended. Um, we try to get those out there as quickly as we can. Uh, you'll see video equipment in all the rooms. We've been a little more aggressive this year about uh, making sure that we capture high quality video of all the presentations and um, they will be available also on the website within a month but uh, um, likely sooner than a month, month after the conference ends. Um, so look for those, and we'll send out notifications to you. Um, some of you who were in the courses last night did not get your course certificates. If you want them, uh, come see us at the front desk, and we'll make sure that you get those. Um, yeah, okay. And then uh, we, we're starting something new this year. Uh, I'd like to acknowledge the founder of Saturn, Linda Northrup, who's uh, sitting right up here. Uh, uh, 
And so in Linda's honor, we've started the Linda M. Northrup Software Architecture Award this year. Um, that's given to an individual or team that has used software architecture to significantly improve practices in an organization or in the software development community. And um, we had uh, some submissions this year, and uh, Eljo Port, who was the winner of the award, here's Eljo over here. And at our final session on Thursday, uh, Linda will be giving a keynote, and Eljo will be uh, giving a talk um, as you know, part of part of the uh, the award, and we'll confer a uh, a valuable award to you too, a, a physical memento of our appreciation. Um, so they'll talk on Thursday. Um, you saw the cards on your seats. Uh, save the date. Saturn next year will be May one to four in Denver. Um, so at this time, uh, I'm really pleased to present to you uh, our, our co-chairs, uh, Amin Chigani and Jorn Olmheim. And uh, these guys have done a terrific job. So let's uh, <laughs> give them a round of applause. OK, thank you. All right, good morning and welcome to Saturn 2016. Uh, and to the beautiful San Diego. Last time I was here, I left with a swollen foot an unimaginable pain from a stingray sting. So it is a beautiful city, beautiful beach, stay away from the water. <laughs> so aside from that, uh, Amin Chigani, I'm the co uh, technical co-chair along with uh, Jörn Almheim, and I would like to spend a moment to walk you through uh, the program for the next few days, give you tips of how you can navigate uh, uh, the, the brochure that you guys have, the rooms, and perhaps select the sessions that, that you guys uh, uh, came here to see. So first of all is the format. So we've, uh, we've uh, put the program in a way that we will start and end here at Bel Air Bell Room. So the program starts with a plenary and ends with, with, with one. So this way we'll all be together in the morning and in the afternoon making sure that in the following uh, uh, break uh, after each we're able to mingle and, 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 and network. We set up the program in four different tracks or four different rooms, Fairbanks A, B, C, and D. Uh, a, B, and C have the three tracks of the conference. IoT uh, uh, is uh, especially in the Fairbanks A, so if you are for the IoT track, uh, make sure you look at the uh, sessions in uh, Fairbanks A. B and C are for the other three tracks within, uh, within our call for submission, so that's uh, architecture methods and design patterns, uh, technology and tools, and uh, leadership uh, uh, and business. Fairbanks D is for our special sessions. That is basically the architecture uh, uh, boot camp sessions. These are distilled SEI courses in 90 minutes. Uh, we have uh, workshops there. We also have the office hours in Fairbanks D. So that is special session ABC is for your regular program. Uh, we've dedicated this year uh, a special track to architecture for Internet of Things, so make sure you, um, um, uh, you see those, those, those sessions. We have four keynotes uh, uh, this year, we're very lucky. Uh, I think up one. Uh, we have Grady Bush from IBM, we have Joe Salvo from GE, Danielle Jackson from MIT, and of course we have our, uh, Linda Northrop uh, closing in uh, on Thursday. We've invited six uh, invited speakers, and I just want to mention them by name as you look through the sessions. Amit Fisher from IBM, uh, Jamie Smith from National Instrument, uh, Ben Hendman from Mesosphere, Eljo Port, of course our winner from CGI, e, uh, uh, Owen Woods from Indava, and finally, uh, finally, Patrick Koa from ThoughtWorks. So look for those sessions of, if you're interested. A, the special edition for this year, at least that's what we try uh, to do, is to put a little spin on what we've done in the past. We've introduced a new session called Dev at Saturn. So this is basically our version of a TED talk on architecture. So we've selected four of those. They'll be at the end of today and tomorrow. So make sure uh, uh, you give those guys a uh, hard time. Um, <laughs> The uh, one thing that uh, we do at Saturn is we try to outreach outside of our community. And this year, we've selected to outreach to uh, young kids. So that's why we're bringing in the IoT and kids. Uh, we're bringing in Kent Myers. He's a technologist, but he's been 
volunteer to teach kids technology and they develop an IoT course. So bring your cameras tomorrow, uh, whether it's phone cameras or real cameras, and come get inspired. You'll see kids between 12 and 14 building an IoT solutions from the ground up. Um, so give them your encouragement, but also get inspired. Architecture boot camp session, this is something that we thought would be excellent for anybody who hasn't attended Saturn before. So if you ha haven't taken an SEI course, haven't attended Saturn, so make sure you take one of those two courses. Again, that's Fairbanks D. These are SEI courses, distilled crash courses in 90 minutes. So make sure you, you get those. Uh, and finally, uh, we, have a, uh, uh, we have MJ uh, Broadband, uh, user experience designer. She's gonna do a workshop on uh, visual communications. A lot of us, do a lot of things with our hands on the board and the whiteboard. So it's a limited seating, 20 sessions. So I see it's almost full, but uh, make sure you, um, after this, you can catch up the last seats in there. And of course, uh, the award, this is the first Linda Northrop Architecture Award. Uh, we're gonna close Thursday with a great lineup with Linda, followed by uh, the winner of the award. So please make sure you stick around until the end of Thursday. Uh, I promise we'll get you out of here by 4.30 on Thursday. So uh, again, I would like to welcome you to Saturn and, and, uh, and uh, wish you the best of time in the next three days. All right. Right. So um, now we're uh, about ready for the main event this morning. Uh, I'm sure most of you know uh, our next speaker. Um, if not for uh, general work on software design and architecture of, of, of over the years, his time at IBM where he still is working as a chief scientist for both uh, software engineering and the Watson Group. He's uh, been uh, doing a number of things over the years, uh, uh, had many great awards. He's uh, ACM fellow, IEEE fellow, and IBM fellow. I mean. All of this, uh, you can find all the details in the, in the bio on, the, on our page if you don't uh, know him already. Um, all in all, his work speaks for itself. So I guess we'll welcome now up to the stage Grady Booch for our first keynote here.